Hey, what's up fam? Welcome to another installation of how to do it right. Uh, we get started here with the story time theater. Step one, battery is not included. So you wanna get four C batteries, pop that out. You're gonna need a star point screwdriver. Put that in. There's a switch, there's, there's an on off switch. Switch that on, boom, flip. Uh, so in the back here, you just uh, kind of hold that until, the, until it lights up over on this side. And you should see something like that. That says story time. All right, uh, you put, all right, so you just kind of pop that in right there. And the next thing that you go to is your, your iPad or your iPhone or whatever it is you're using. Boom. So you see the Wi-Fi is going to connect it be connected to your home Wi-Fi, which is the default. What you would look for is story time, and it would probably have a different number there. You hit story time. I'm already logged in, so it connects me to story time. So I'm linked to the projector, but I am not linked to, to the regular Wi-Fi. So I'm going to back up just a little bit. And what we want to do before we even do that is download the app called Storytime. Once the app is downloaded, you'll go back to your Wi-Fi, follow the steps, click on Storytime, put the code in. The code for the Wi-Fi is usually located in the manual. Um, you close that out. You jump into the app. The app will usually bring you to this screen. You would go to unlock books. Boom. Right there, the number that it's asking you for there is found on the back of the, the little thing here, right there. You pop that in permanently unlock it's going to take five or six maybe ten minutes to download and once you've done that uh, the next time you come in you can go to library your library and the book that was downloaded you see these all have locks on them these are the locks this one no lock boom hit that and then you have an option read to me uh, if you do read to me then you have to kind of scroll through after it's finished reading when Princess the first Elsa page and Princess Anna of Arendelle you'll have to turn the page uh, read myself naturally there would be no speaking and nighttime reading or bedtime reading would actually scroll from one screen to the next whilst this uh thing is playing in the background there's actually something that will be happening and so let's take a look at what happens when we hit play when princess elsa and princess anna of arendelle were little girls they were the best of friends anna was one of the only people who knew elsa's secret Elsa had the power to make snow and ice. One night, Elsa filled an empty ballroom. So what you just see happen, there was a still photo. That's the only thing that's changing. And there's like random snowflakes falling in the background. That's it. You got any more questions about how to make this happen? Hit me up at www.d.d dot o r g boom